All right, here we go. Today is the day. Checking out for Brazil. Going vlog style here. But pretty excited. Not excited for the 12 hour red eye that's about to go down. Probably gonna be my least favorite part of the whole trip. But right, you'll find out soon how that goes. Here we go. Got off the 10 hour red eye overnight. It wasn't actually too bad. Took some NyQuil. Was able to sleep like five hours. It's pretty stressed out. I was gonna be doomed and just be up all night, but NyQuil kicked in and I was able to get a good amount of sleep. So going through passport stuff now, and then I'll be at my hotel. Here we go. City, being the tourist, looking at the things on the side of the road, right in front of me here. I'm not really sure what's going on. I got guys getting off a boat on it's horses. On one. Yeah. Oh. Kind of cool. Yeah, so I don't really know what's going on. Maybe the world's first CrossFitters back here pulling a boat off a beach. But yeah, kind of cool. Only people, I think, in this whole city look at us right now. But we're tourists. It's what we do. On our way to the athlete briefing in style. I'm just looking for some sweet jumps to go off of here real quick. Bring me back to elementary school. Brother's rolling up on the bike, ringing his bell, checking out some birds. Fly, go. All right, just walked in here with my handy dandy coach. Go, Going for the first event here, trying to find out how to check in. It's pretty hard because no one here speaks English, <laughs> so I end up trying to guess what they're saying and end up in weird positions. But yeah, a lot of people here, pretty long lines, which is sweet. Lots of, just a ton of little vendors. But yeah, I'm gonna go watch some people swim and I'll be swimming here in an hour or so, a little muggy out. But hopefully my coach here can give me some good advice. Got Dan, him, best coach. Best any, coach in the comp. Any, sw any, oh. any swimming advice here for me? I breathe every three strokes. Okay. Two if breaths. I if I could breathe every yeah, I three got that strokes, Colorado air. yeah, sea level air. If I could breathe every three strokes, I'll probably end up doing pretty well. But here you go. <laughs> Happy with how it went in the pool, finished 15th, did way worse than I did in training, but made a mistake, came out way too hot, crashed and burned. Event two, I won my heat and moved up to eighth place overall, so today I'm starting off in the final heat, most competitive heat, which will be good. I'm heading over there here in a few minutes, and rare rock and roll. Three events today, so the leaderboard after today is going to look way different, hopefully for the better, but... You never know. These events are pretty good for me, but we'll see. I don't know how good these guys are, truly. It's pretty crazy here. I've yet to see the sun. It's just been, like, muggy out the whole time. I'll let you see what it looks like outside my hotel room. Just kind of just kind of muggy, but the sun's supposed to come out when I go to Rio. Afterwards, hopefully I can go to Rio with a good place so I can have a good time on vacation up there at the beach. <laughs>
strategy going into it. Double unders I usually struggle with. If I could come back to the bike on the second bike and lay the hammer, Sorry, that was my goal. And I knew I could do well, so the second bike I really was able to push it. And I laid it down and I felt good at the end. I was able to hang on. Down here, how do you feel? Awesome. So I usually train at elevation in the mountains, and right now I'm at sea level. So that alone has made a huge difference. I just aerobic capacity. I can just take in way more air. Feel way better. And then the town of Brazil. Sorry, I'm still breathing. <laughs> the town of Brazil is awesome. First time here in South America. Everyone's super friendly, but I don't speak Portuguese. So that's a hard block to deal with. But I love it down here. Great experience. Okay, did that sound place pretty dope free massages recovery work just got one done people laying down they just call it the recovery room hot cold baths behind me and we got some boots right here like Norma Tech if you want to put them on it's pretty sweet got a few massages this weekend just tried to rub out my biceps before I go blow them up on these muscle ups but loving it Competition, going to Rio, a couple days, a little bit of beach, a little bit of beer, hopefully relax a little bit. See you on the other side. Just got here, beach somewhere in the background here with my coach. With us, Caprinas. Caprinas, Caprinas, starting the vacation off right. I haven't drank alcohol in about a month or so. Here we go. Only one scooter. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. All right, <clears throat> found the pull-up rig. Now the goal is just to sucker some Brazilian into doing some a bar, bar muscle up workout with me. But looks a little janky, but we'll see what I got here. Oh, I can't slick. <laughs> Not bad, not bad, pretty good. I don't always feel tall, but when I'm in a tram going up Sugarloaf Mountain, I feel like a giant. Everyone's so much shorter than me. They're tiny. Going up Sugarloaf Mountain on the tram, about to be on top of Rio. Up here, very top. Coach behind me. Here we go. Yep. Pretty 
pretty crazy up here. Back here behind me, can't really see it. I ain't got on top of that mountain. Christ the Redeemer. Out here hiking up to the Christ the Redeemer statue. Had a little hard time finding the trail. We see a couple people kind of ask them where we're going. Every time they just look at us like we're crazy and they tell us to be careful. So probably should have brought my dart gun, left it back at the hotel. So it's going to have to make old Coach Dan do a little jogging if we see some sketchy people. So wish us luck. Be out here looking for monkeys. These trees are big, but in the thick of it, hiking through the jungle. Cool little ladder thing here, almost all the way up. We're about to see the grizzly bear make his attempt. Prepare yourself. Nice. Ah. <laughs> Almost there. Oh! Where are we at? Cristo! <laughs> Cristo! <laughs> Good luck, look at us. You got 60, 60 pounds off. <laughs> 60 pound so ankle weights on each leg, pretty crazy. Bunch of ankle weights here. I'm gonna try and tow the bar with some ankle weights. <laughs> it's enough with the ankle weights. Now we need to get a little. back to the beach again tonight probably drinking a few capybaras my brother's dressed on capybaras daniel's dressed all nice <laughs> out here trying to practice our surfing skills <laughs> nothing's gonna work out nothing's gonna work out but we're gonna we're gonna do our best <laughs> 